My journey started at 19 years old, and like many at this age, I had no money, no connections, no education or background in the industry that I wanted to start. The only thing that I knew how to do was bootstrap, and that was essentially the way that I would start my company. Bootstrapping is an approach taken by many who don't have the financial cushions or the financial security knowing that they'll be all right if they don't make it. The minimalist entrepreneur knows the power of leveraging time and money. They know you don't need money to make money. It's about leveraging your resources, having a clear focus and strategy. For me and many others who start this way, taking this approach eventually brings on success, such as being featured on national TV, large business publications, and keeping the business going regardless of the obstacles that confront us every single day. So the real question here is, how is it possible to make money with no money? Most people you talk to will say that in order to successfully start a business, you'll need a million dollars in funding in order to make sure that you have the financial cushion available for you to start. And many startup companies do just that. They go out and raise that million dollars in funding, have the flashy rides, post all over social media telling you how amazing things are, and then next year, they're no longer in business. We live in a generation that wants instant satisfaction. Social media has shaped us to believe that if we don't get that like as soon as we post that picture, or if we don't get that success as soon as we launch our projects, then we weren't good enough, and perhaps we should call it quits. But as a minimalist entrepreneur, we need to reframe that way of thinking, and we need to realize that we're in it for the long run. A big part of being an entrepreneur means knowing where and who to turn to for answers. It's about being resourceful. It's not about being fancy. Being resourceful doesn't cost anything, and it truly is a difference between winning and losing the game. The definition of an entrepreneur is a person who organizes and operates a business or businesses taking on greater than normal financial risk in order to do so. For those that go all in, mortgage the house, car, and even the dog, they risk more than just humiliation if they fail. Oftentimes they risk being homeless, they risk losing their kids, friends, family, their beloved dog, and everything that they truly care about in pursuit of chasing something because they thought that they needed to put in all the funds in order to make it work. Make 50,000 mops, borrowing and owing every dollar, including your home. It could have been handled better. And those around them that see them fail, see this failure and really question themselves if they should even start on their own journey. For others who are just graduating high school or college, they fear of missing out on life's adventures. Everything that life has to give them when they're just starting out in their early 20s, the freedom that they're just experiencing, the fear of missing out on everything if their businesses fail. Either case holds us back until we have that financial security or that time to do it. But that limiting belief that we need more time, we need more people, we need more money, we need more things in order to do this is the reason that many of us fail to start and even start on this journey. By now you may be wondering, okay, what is a minimalistic approach to entrepreneurship and how can I apply it to my life? Taking a minimalistic approach to entrepreneurship means that you need to be budget savvy. It's about knowing where to spend and having the right tools for the job. You see, just because it's advertised as a solution and the thing that your business needs in order to take off does not mean that you have to mortgage the house for it. It's about having less distractions in your life and not caring about what the world has to say about your dreams and your goals. More importantly, it's about having a positive mental attitude and daily habits that'll get you through the challenges that every single day will bring in life. A minimalistic approach to entrepreneurship means getting to cash flow positive as fast as possible. This means having as little overhead as you can in order to obtain this. Instead of starting out with a budget for a large office or warehouse, it means getting a shared working space or perhaps starting it out of your garage or living room table until the physical demand exceeds what you have available. The minimalistic entrepreneur knows the power of leveraging time and money. This doesn't mean not investing into the talent that'll help them grow their business, it means knowing when to take that task on themselves in order to move the business forward. The right circle of influence and the people that surround you are the utmost importance to this way of life. You see, we all have an emotional currency and that's a currency that we need to be very aware of and protective of and we need to realize who's taking from it and who's adding to it in our everyday life. You need to add more people to your life that add to your emotional currency and subtract those people from your life that are only draining it. 
Now that's not always easy to do, and sometimes our closest family members are the ones that affect us the most. So in this case, it means giving yourself more space and perhaps getting that shared co-working space to get you out of the house and more productive. It's about having the right strategy and platform and the right product or service. One without the other cannot exist. It's about finding out if the market is ready for it, and it's about testing before investing. I'm here to tell you that it's possible to start out of your garage or living room. All right, I'm here to tell you that the, some of the greatest companies ever founded in this world all started out this way. If you can integrate your business into your everyday life, if you can minimize the distractions that occur in everyday life, working out of a garage or out of a home bedroom office or the living room table can be a blessing in disguise. So contrary to popular belief, you don't need that multi-million dollar investment in order to get your brand off the ground. You don't need the flashy cars, you don't need the flashy office, and you don't need that flashy equipment in order to get started. The minimalistic approach to entrepreneurship solely relies on your ability to execute with what you do have. And more importantly, it means waking up every single day, counting your blessings, and always being ready to win. Hey guys, if you enjoyed this video, I ask that you subscribe to this channel, hit the notification bell in order to get the most recent updates, share this video with a friend, and if you're looking to start a brand or business, I started a new program and it's called From the Ground Up Academy, where we help you build your brand or business from the ground up. Download your free guides right here into the website, you'll find them here. Check out the most recent videos on the channel, and I look forward to seeing you guys in the next one. Bye.